hi guys welcome back to my channel it has literally been a month or more since i've vlogged or posted anything or filmed anything um i was going to continue filming over the holidays and christmas and i had a storage issue first you guys probably remember my camera broke and um, I've been using this one. It's my other Canon, but it's humongous, so it's really hard to vlog with. Um, like right now, my arm's already tired, and I've only been holding it for like two seconds. But um, yeah, so my camera broke, but I've been using this one. But then I was having a storage issue with my Mac, so we had to figure that out and get a new hard drive, and it was a pain in the butt. So I kind of took that time to just take a little break anyway, and it was actually really nice to kind of just not think about filming or of course I love filming but you know not think about having to upload or um, worry about getting the camera out um, I do wish I filmed a Christmas vlog though because I I never have for some reason I feel like the holidays I always don't film when it should really be the opposite but um, I think I'm gonna have to put my camera on my stand to chat with you guys because it's really heavy. Uh, yeah, I hope everyone had a great holiday. We had a really nice Christmas, really simple New Year's. My dad was out here for Christmas, which was amazing because you guys know the rest of my family is back in Vegas. So it was really nice to have my dad here and spend time with the kids. And um, what else has been going on? I lightened my hair. I don't know if you can tell. I got some blonde highlights put in there. Um, I was loving it dark, but after a while I always get Board, and I always go back and forth between blonde and brunette always it's just like I can't help myself so I'm in the process of lightening it just a little I don't think I'm gonna go full blonde but just a little bit Trav and I have been working out at the gym now I have not been in the gym since before I was even pregnant with Ryan so you know during quarantine we started the whole home workouts me and my girlfriends had that challenge going on and you know, I filmed a lot of that, me and Travis doing the workouts at our apartment in Vegas. And as much as we loved that and it felt good and motivating, there's just nothing like actually, in my opinion, Mommy. being in the gym and Mommy. lifting weights and actually using a, the equipment. Mommy you had this a uh, big bottle and, and you put it on your hand and it was um 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 yeah. What? Yeah. Baby bottle on my head? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. And what's on your face? Is that Manny? We got Chick-fil-A for lunch, which uh, that goes hand in hand with saying we've been working out, I know. So my next goal is to completely eat clean. I'm struggling with that still because I'm always hungry. I'm still breastfeeding Ryan um, and working out. I've been hungrier too, so yeah. But anyways, being in the gym has been so nice. Me and Travis go together. And thank God my in-laws are awesome and they watch the kids at night once dinner's done and the kids are like in their pajamas. They'll watch them and we'll head off to the gym and it's like our time to spend together. And um, honestly, it's really important. We, we really, other than that, don't have a lot of time, just us. So that's been awesome. And yeah, I figured I would just get back to vlogging and possibly do a day in the life video. This might actually be in combination with a vlog tomorrow too because today's already halfway done. I didn't start vlogging this morning like I wanted to. It was kind of a crazy morning because we had school drop off and then play group. We have Tuesdays and Thursdays where I take the boys at 9.30 and then we went to Starbucks and Chick-fil-A. So we're home and we leave again to get Kylie from school in about an hour. So today's a little bit hectic but oh and then we have dance. So Tuesdays are the crazy days, but I miss you guys. I miss putting up vlogs. I miss filming in general. And honestly, I didn't even feel like really doing starting it today. But once I just started talking to you guys now, I'm in the mood and I'm going to pick it back up. So um, I always ask this, but let me know if there's anything you want to see and I will try to film it for you guys. Um, I'm probably going to put on my Fabletics outfit here in a minute and show you guys. I get a Fabletics order every month and I've been working with them and I'm seriously loving their stuff and working out in it. I really do. I wear it to the gym. My favorite leggings are from Fabletics. So I'm gonna show you guys that. And yeah. So as you guys can probably see, the kids got massive amounts of toys for Christmas. Santa was a little too good and we actually had to buy this um, toy storage and this one. We got them both at this one we got at Target, this one we got at 
BJ's and obviously we have to organize it better but um, at night we pick it up pretty nicely but obviously during the day the kids kind of put everything in all sorts of different places but for now it's working for us and we did get rid of some old toys before Christmas but not too many so they still have quite a bit Ryan got a whole bunch of good stuff. Oh, is it stuck? And of course, he still loves that so much. He got that for his birthday. And put that in the garage. Look. Show them how it goes down here. Show them. Other side. Yep. Here you go. <laughs> I was going to put on my Fabletics outfit and show you guys, but it's really dirty because I wore it to the gym last night, so I didn't really want to put it on again. We have so much laundry backed up because our dryer broke, and um, my father-in-law took it apart, and we're getting our new one Thursday or tomorrow, so we can't do any laundry until tomorrow. So we're a little backed up. Try again. Yeah, most days I cruise through the day pretty well, especially with my coffee. We got an espresso. That's another thing. We got an um, espresso machine for Christmas, and it's been amazing. If I, you know, I like my Starbucks, and I still do get it, but during the days that I don't leave the house or we don't go out right away, it's so nice to have that to kind of wake me up and get me going. But for some reason today, I feel so tired. I think, honestly, it is probably... The fact that we've been working out and my legs are really tired. We're gonna be super sore tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I feel exhausted, so. We're almost there. We should be moving up in the car line literally any minute. But he started freaking out. And I would normally take him out in the car line, but since we're about to move, I'm gonna have to put him right back in. So he's just gonna have to cry for a few minutes till we move up, and once we start moving, he should stop. Look at mommy without falling. Where's your other shoe? Gym attire is on. We're gonna go to the gym, get this workout done. We're gonna do back and buys today. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I'm glad to be back vlogging. Got a quick little breakfast going on. We just did some scrambled eggs, bacon. I have this banana bread that I wanted to try, and it's actually really good. But I don't know if the kids are gonna eat it. Blackberries, raspberries, and then Ryan has one of his um, breakfast pouches that he had left over. So. Huh? No, yes, no, 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 no.
Rectangles. Oh, his fruit snacks? Yeah. Good boy, saying rectangles. You ready for breakfast? Yes! Okay. Mom, I need to turn to, to this. I give you a fork. <laughs> <laughs> Did it blend in with your plate? Huh? Did it blend in with your plate? Yeah. Okay. Liam specifically requested eggs this morning. He doesn't always eat them for me, but today he wanted them, huh? Is it good? Um, I ended the vlog last night, but I actually wanted to continue vlogging a little bit today just to kind of share with you guys what's going on. So remember my last, was it my last vlog? I think I might have had one after that where I talked about our dentist experience with Liam and how terrible it was. Well... Turns out he does need some work done. We actually got a second opinion after that appointment and needing the work done wasn't the problem I had. It was obviously how the dentist treated us, but um, we do need a filling for him. I think he needs to, which I'm not proud of. There's times where they have too much sugar and now he's got two cavities. So the problem is since he's so afraid of the dentist, they want to put him under complete sedation and he has been under once for his ears, he has ear tubes, but I am so nervous about putting him under at such a young age and I've heard from a couple of different doctors that they don't like to put children under for their teeth unless they're over four years old or it's an absolute emergency like there's pain or an abscess or the cavity is to the root and it's really, really bad. And that's why I've been having, I've been struggling so much with what to do and I don't know what I'm gonna do. And that's why we're going to another dentist today to get a third opinion. So our insurance covered it. They're not getting another cleaning, but he is getting a, um, or he's not getting another cleaning, but he is getting another opinion. And they're gonna tell me what they think about if he really should be put under or not. We don't know what we're gonna do yet. So that's why we're going today. Travis is coming with me. Thank God he can get a couple hours off of work to come with me because since the other one went so badly, I now want him with me for these appointments. I don't know if they're gonna let both of us back with Liam because of COVID, but we're gonna see. So I'm gonna fill you guys in because a couple of you have reached out to me after that video and you know expressed how terrible you think that Dennis treated everything and how you know it shouldn't have been done that way. And yeah, so I appreciate that. So I wanna fill you guys in. I'm not excited about this. Liam hates the dentist. I've been trying to kind of work with him to get him a little bit more comfortable, but we're gonna see how it goes. So they're eating breakfast now. We have to leave here in about like an hour, um, so it's not too much of a rush. Um, I have tons of laundry to finish because like I told you guys, my dryer was broken, but we finally fixed it. So I can get some laundry done today. And that's pretty much it. I haven't even brushed my teeth yet. I have no makeup on, so yeah. We're gonna get that done now, and then we're gonna head off to get Travis and go to the- Hey okay, guys, so I still never ended this vlog. This is turning into like a three-day video. I've been really bad with vlogging, obviously, and I was talking to you guys about the dentist. We were on our way to the dentist the other day, and I never told you what happened. So the boys, or Liam, has to get his cavities filled at a surgery center, and he's too young to just have laughing gas or numbing, so it's kind of a whole ordeal that's kind of making me nervous. So, unfortunately, he does have a couple cavities. Um, not proud of that, but we're gonna get it taken care of, and otherwise, it went pretty well. My kids have been fighting all day. Stop. Right now. So I'm gonna be ending the vlog here. Tomorrow I'm gonna film again, and we're gonna be doing like a day in the life, kind of my routine with the kids. Kylie has off of school today for Martin Luther King Day, and tomorrow is like a teacher day. So we're gonna have, try to have a fun day. I'm going to use my mom voice for a second. Um, I'm also gonna attempt making vanilla cupcakes from scratch. I don't know what in the world possessed me to wanna do this for no reason. I think it's because my sister's been baking it's all gone. Those, I don't know where you guys put those. I'll look in a second. My sister's been baking a lot and making the most delicious looking cupcakes and it's been making me wanna try. So I've been following Preppy Kitchen on here on YouTube and Instagram and his recipes just look awesome. 
So I'm gonna attempt to make them, and also uh, Liam's birthday is in March, so I'm gonna try to make his birthday cake. It'll be the first time I make one of the kids cakes ever. I'm usually just the type that likes to go to the bakery and get it. So we're gonna try that tomorrow. Good, and I thought it'd be fun to vlog it so you guys can see if they come out good or a disaster. I'm just making my own um, cupcakes, obviously, and then my own buttercream. And it's my first time ever doing it, um, but they just sounded so good and looked so good, so I really want to try. So I already have all the ingredients I need, so we're going to try them tomorrow when we have some time. We don't have to go anywhere, really, because um, there's no school. So, yes, I'm going to finally end the vlog here. Thank you guys for sticking with me through this, like, choppy day-to-day um, -day vlog. Let me know if there's anything you want to see. And I can't wait to get back to a schedule. I'm really trying to get back to a vlogging schedule. It makes me feel good to be consistent, whether you guys watch them or not. It just feels good to be consistent with it and get back to my schedule. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in our next one.